hello and greetings. This is video number six on the video series of uh, managing MB uh, media server. On this video, I'll show why uh, your MB server is only recording uh, 19 or 20 minutes of the, the live TV when you put it on a schedule. You looked at all the time, you looked at everything. I, I've spent three weeks messing with this thing. Uh, going back and forth, I even use the beta version. Um, but let me go ahead and jump right in, and I can actually keep on jabbering as as I'm going along. So let me go into my media server. Um, one nine nine. Okay. So the issue is that once you log in and you look at your live TV, the, I have it more for the kids, um, and that's where it became kind of an issue where the recordings were just half. And for whatever reason, it would, it would, it would just drop off. And I had uh, put the, the, the time, I had adjusted the time, uh, I made sure the time was scheduled and all kinds of stuff. It really boiled down to, and let me show you that the recordings are, um, see, 29 minutes. Uh, the difference is that I am not, you'll notice here at the bottom, uh, let me zoom in. You'll notice that the file is actually a, a, the proprietary TS file, um, video format. Um, what I noticed is when the server was told to uh, transcode at the same time, for whatever reason, it always got to, uh, on some of the the smaller shows like some of the Alvin and the chipmunk ones that that my kids watch um, it would drop off like at 10 or 12 minutes um, I'll show you a picture uh, and whoever's going through this issue they're gonna know exactly what's going on uh, desktop oh, desktop here it is right here so you'll notice uh, that it only recorded 19 minutes yet it started at the right time and everything started fine. Is it would just drop off for whatever reason? Probably ninety percent of them were at nineteen minutes for whatever odd reason. I don't know about that. I haven't got a word back on tech support from that. But anyways, moving on. Your issue is here um, when you go into live TV and you go into settings. Let me zoom in. Uh, okay, and you go into your settings, and right here, this is the corporate. Right? The the when you actually do um, automatic convert recording, the machine seems to have an issue. Uh, Textport was telling me that um, the issue could be that my I use HD Home Run as my tuners. I have a couple of them. So, anyways, that's beside the point. The point being that it was always at 19 minutes. I updated the firmware on, on the HD Home Run. I did all that. And sure enough, it had nothing to do with HD Home Run because Myth TV was recording fine. So just untack that and you'll notice that at, at that point, then you're gonna, your recordings are gonna be fine. The issue that is arise out of that is that the files are bigger um, to push through so what I did is I set up a rsync uh, command um, so let me go ahead and show you that part actually before I jump into that let me show you the software that I actually installed I have installed it on this particular computer so let me go ahead and dump it in the software that is used now I've used handbrake in the past and I use a couple other ones uh, the issue with when you're doing a lot of videos is it takes a long time um, and the MKV tool tunics they are very fast um, and I'll do a Linux one a Windows and a Mac this one I'm gonna do as a Windows I mean Linux because that's what I'm on right now so we'll go through that or you know what uh, let's do this so the video doesn't get long. Um, I'll show on the next video how you actually install it and so forth. So I'll see you on the next one.